Hey guys, it's Friday night and I'm in my pajamas. Uh, reindeer, candy canes, and socks that are probably getting dirty. Uh, Friday, Black Friday, day after Thanksgiving. When I showered this morning, I really over-conditioned my hair. Do you guys ever do that and then it feels stringy and greasy all day? I had it pulled back in a barrette. Um, anyways... We started out our day with going to Chick-fil-A for breakfast and barely made it. They didn't have any more hash browns left, so I only got the little chicken minis. And then we went to Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, they had the 20% off coupon, your total purchase, and the coupon could be used all day. And um, But we, we just did our shopping right then and there. The lines weren't bad. They had all the registers open, so that was nice. And then we... I was going to go to Michael's and Mark went to get his hair cut and I went into Michael's and the line just wrapped, uh, came out from the cash registers, came up around and S back around the other way and then went down to the back of the store. And I had three things in my basket because I figured I had a 20 minute window to shop. And I looked at the line, I said, uh, yeah, I just put everything back. I had, um, some like foam stickers. And I put those back in some um, picks. And I called it a day. I said, yeah, I'm not going to stand that line. And I went up and waited for Mark to finish getting his hair cut. And then we, um, the way we went home, I said, let me run into the Dollar Tree. So I did videotape my Bed Bath & Beyond. I'll put that up. And then I did a small Dollar Tree. I don't know if anybody's interested, but I'm going to put it up anyways because I just haven't really had anything to record about, I guess. Um, yesterday was Thanksgiving. Weird day. I got up at four because Fluff wanted to go out and I couldn't fall back asleep and I finally did it at 5.30 and then I slept till nine or was it 9.30? It was late. I usually don't sleep that late in the day and then, um, cooked and took like a nap and woke back up and then took another nap. And then I was in bed by, well, no, I stayed up. I stayed up to like 12.30. We were watching um, our recorded Survivor. So we're down to one episode left to watch. Now if I see the commercials, I won't freak so much. Survivor, I know, has been on forever. Uh, 16 years. Um, and I've watched it from day one. So I'm not a Big Brother person. I'm more of a Survivor fan. And... Uh, you know, reality TV has came in, has kind of petered off, and now it's, I don't know, where it's at in the world. Um, so that's what I did yesterday. How was everybody's Thanksgiving? I had off work. I actually worked late. I worked early Monday, late Tuesday, and then started early Wednesday and worked late Wednesday. And I just felt like, oh, I think that's why I slept so much, because I just finally felt that relief of, I have four days off. I don't have to worry about things and, you know, just get stuff done around the house for a change. Never did the painting. Um, yesterday was turkey day. Today, did that little bit of shopping. And then I came home and uh, raked the leaves. And let me just rant about that for a minute. I could just really get really pissy about it because it makes me mad thinking about it. But we had that big windstorm last weekend. It was really nice on Saturday. And then Saturday night, that all that, you know, um, from the Midwest blew our way. And we had leaves just jam-packed into every little thing you could imagine. And so I raked two bags of leaves today. And I felt like just like being Santa Claus. Take the leaves around, drop them off in everybody's yard and say, thank you. Here's your leaves back. Um, I mean, no biggie, they're leaves, but... Uh, you know, just my neighbors or whatever. I'm sure they get mad when I if the wind blows the other way, right? But uh, it just makes me mad because I was out there raking leaves and like everybody's yard is like pristine clean because, oh, they're all laying in my yard. But that's no big deal. I normally just leave them lay there. But, uh, you know, because they provide some insulation for my my plants and, you know, the kitties can use them as a litter box. I did leave the back ones lay. I didn't bother with them. I just got the front ones that were laying around all the uh, the bushes and called it a day on that. 
and then um, start doing some cleaning and just things, you know, you just, just never, never, ever get done. And I just started doing those things. My hands are so dry from washing and then they've been in cleaner and um, it's probably 4.30ish now. Yeah, I have the one the blinds still up. I'll pull them here when I'm done. But um, it was 51 when we were out shopping, so not too bad. We got some spitting snow. That's what it was last Saturday. It was, uh, it got to nearly 70 degrees. And when I went to bed, it was snowing. And I'm like, wow, that is crazy. But that's, you know, Pennsylvania for you. Just what it does. Um, but it was pretty nice here today. I don't know when we're supposed to get snow again. Hopefully not for a while. But, um, you know, it's like just bleh, out winter. Winter's coming. That's my week. Work. You know, uh, complaining about the neighbors. I really don't care. I mean, really, it is what it is. And, uh um, getting some decorating starting, started. I did put out some stuff on Saturday when it was nice, and my neighbor says, you're not putting anything out yet, are you? It's too nice. And I'm like, uh, so why would I want to be bundled up in the snow doing this? Do it when it's nice out. Anyways, I did put up my garland, and I just noticed my lights popped on, so I put my lights up yesterday. And, uh, that's really it. That's me for the outside. Don't do too much. Went to bed, Bath and Body Works. Monday, yeah, Monday I think I went. Or Tuesday, no, Monday. Yeah. Um, had to get the, you know, I get those coupons. I don't really, I don't think I really buy that much Bath and Body Works, first of all. So maybe that's why I get those coupons. It was like something, something, and I just remember a free signature, full-size signature collection item with any purchase. So I wanted to use that because it expires in a couple of days, and there was no way I was participating in that Bath & Body Works thing today. I went, I think, last year or the year before, and it was like a madhouse in there. And I don't need a tote bag, so, and I don't need like three free or something free. They'll have, eventually have the soap, um day here in a couple weeks and that's like my big thing to soap but I have so much soap right now um that I wasn't worried about stopping and oh Yankee Candle they're sell I looked I was going to I mean I was right over by there and I thought I could just slip in get what I wanted slip out and um I wasn't impressed I don't need another tote bag and um I didn't see like milk cups on sale, and that's probably what I would have what I would have picked up. And um, I have a hair on me. So, anyways, picked up the gingerbread latte. I have this soap in my bathroom right now. You know what? There's warm vanilla sugar in this. The more I use that soap in there, the more I think eek, it's that warm vanilla. Yeah, brown. Well, it says brown sugar vanilla latte, but it's like warm vanilla sugar. Um. Santa's Gingerbread Frosted Pear Brown Sugar Vanilla Latte Whipped Cream. I think that will be a Christmas gift for my daughter. She never, she always says she wants Bath and Body Works, but, you know, she's a college kid, so she doesn't buy it. So I usually send her throughout the year some Bath and Body Works. I think she'll like that. I don't think the warm vanilla sugar bothers her like it bothers me. You know why it bothers me? My last job I had... The lady, we, I had to share a computer because I worked the night shift. And um, her keyboard was coated in warm vanilla sugar. And I would like, you know, and they were talking years and years ago before like Perel. You know, in my work now we have the, the wipes that you can just pull. And then we have the sanitizers everywhere uh, in the bathroom and in, in the hallways. Um, so I didn't have like the, the disposable hand wipes. And... Um, my hands just reeked of of that warm vanilla sugar every day and it just to the point where you know it almost makes your stomach turn anyways but i'll use that one up in my bathroom but i think i'll give that to her for christmas hmm. i saw a funny what do you call what do you say those are they called memes i saw a funny meme on facebook that said don't forget turn back your scale 10 pounds for thanksgiving 
Yeah, I'm one of those that like tend to like put that weight right on. Um, I'm kind of seeing it in my chubby face right now. Uh, I weighed myself this morning. I mean, I only put a pound on, but still. Anyways, so what my purchase was, was a candle. I know you're thinking, girl, you got a candle. I sure did. This is during their 12.50 sale. Hey, look. Yep, 12.50. So my total was 13.50. And that was with tax. Drop something. So I'll show you what I got. Oh, it's on my receipt, I guess. She got that up good, which I'm glad. Mmm, smells good. Hot cocoa and cream. I know everybody has gotten this and recorded it and showed it and hauled it. Has the um, tree lid, white wax, three wick. That does smell. It's very light cocoa. And I have so many cocoa candles. I think I'll have a cocoa month. Um, it's in the frosted brown glass. I guess there's two versions. There's this version and then there's the white clear um, clear glass with um, brown wax, right? Or something like that. But my store only had three of these left. And I was looking for it when I first walked in. And I said, oh, I hope I find that cocoa one and um it was over in the corner so i went ahead and got it uh and then like i said that was free so i did do the bath and body works earlier in the week this was the coupon they gave me so i have uh, several of those it's good until december 24th uh which means it'll be good during that soap day hmm. I really don't need any more soap. If I get soap, it'll be just a couple ones I haven't picked up or in, you know, um, Christmas gifts. But, hold on, let me get this. We went to Bed Bath & Beyond. I think it was last week we had those 20% um, uh, off single items. And I get one via text. And then I get one in email. And Mark gets his in the, via text as well. And, uh. Oh, you know, no, I take that back. I had one that was 15 off of 50 purchase, something like that. That's what it was. And then I had a 20% off, and he had 20% off. So, I uh, went ahead and picked up two of the Snowball Donut Holes, and it's, it really does smell good. It has cinnamon in it, but it's sweet, and... I don't know what the snowball is. I don't know. But it's not like a, a big donut scent. Um, it's not big on bakery. It's just sweet. So there you can see. It's a brown wax. Um, what else is going on? Uh, it's Friday, so I am getting ready to make dinner. And I'm having, um, I just got some chicken breast I'll cut up into, like, nuggets, strip nuggets. And I have, uh, it's actually beer, is it beer batter mix? Um, uh, you know, you can substitute water, and I'll just, uh, coat it and then deep fry it. And then I have, um, french fries that I'll just make right behind it. And that will be dinner. That sounds like a good dinner, doesn't it? I had to use up that chicken, it. I didn't get my turkey until early in the week, and then I had to like, please, 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 thaw out. But it was just a turkey breast, so everything was good. Um, just kind of chilling. So I, like I said, I did my bed, bath, and beyond. I already recorded that. I'll do that small Dollar Tree, but I'm just kind of working on the craftiness thing and watching TV and watching everybody's videos and um, cleaning. So. That's about it for now. I guess I'll let you guys go. It was fun hanging out again. And um, if you want to see one more look. Oh, yeah. 
I have like summer and I have winter pajamas and these are my winter ones they're heavier um, that reminds me I have to link I'll have a pajamas for Christmas <laughs> Old Navy had them on sale but um, it was I, I went last weekend I think to Old Navy fixing my sock those socks I got at Target for 30 cents I don't know if my, my skin likes them I kind of got a little rash around where the rim of the sock was so I might have to be careful with those um, I, I mean I have washed them so I don't know maybe it's just because you know it's getting winter time and um, drying out and, oh yeah my skin's dry but anyways Hope everyone has a great weekend and thanks for watching and I'll talk to you another day. Bye.